Hey guys, welcome back. Dave Glazer at Fit Life Champions wanting to welcome you to workout number six of your 30 in 30. 30 workouts in 30 days that you can do anywhere, anytime. As you can see, I'm at home. I don't have a whole lot of space to work with, but we don't need it today because we're going to get into a booty burning uh, workout plus a core finisher. So stay with me. We're going to jump right into it. We've got a warm up, three rounds, of 20 jumping jacks and six hop hop drops. So we'll start here. Good, awesome. Back to hop, hop, drop. Hop, hop, drop. Hop, hop, drop. Three more. Good, back to jumping jacks. Muscles warmed up. We want to either come down on the carpet or grab our mat. And I'll turn this at a little bit of an angle so that you can see exactly what's going on. So, lying on our back, flex one leg. We have five flexions at the hip. Good. And switch. Good. Bring that leg, flex it to 90 degrees, drop, and bring it in. You have five of these. Keeping both sides of the hips and both shoulders onto the floor. Four, five, good. All right, turn over on your side. And with legs stacked, we're gonna abduct a straight leg, point the toe towards that wall in front of you. You have five each side, good. Flip to the other side. Good, awesome. <clears throat> a glute bridge. So I don't like to put my feet on the mat, so I balance on my heels and I just drive my hips up. I want you to double it, give me 10. We're driving the hips towards the ceiling. Okay, now that we got that out of the way, these are a little bit harder. So come into a quadruped position, straight leg, and one, two, three, four, five. Switch, point the toe towards the ground, two, three, four, five. And let's do it twice through. Straight leg. We're gonna do this workout, this circuit training three to four times total, and our object is to keep moving. So hang with me here. We're gonna start with hydrants in the quadruped position with knee at 90. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Good, one, two, 
Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. Donkey kicks. One, two. Don't let that front knee touch the ground. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Opposite leg. One, two. Point the toe and push the flat of your foot to the ceiling. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. Single leg glute bridge. Lie on your back. Point this heel into the ground. This leg can either be flexed up in the air or straight. Elbows in the mat. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Ten, awesome. That's a single leg glute version, glute bridge version. I'm going to take you through a bench, two legged version. You can do this on the ottoman. You can do this on the couch. You can do this on the chair. Dip, drive, dip, drive. You can put something heavy on your hips if this isn't hard enough. Good, you can do this single leg version. <laughs> That's hard. Good, awesome. Now I'm sliding my mat to the side or just maintain right here on the carpet. We're gonna go into a split squat. First, one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten. I'll do this from the side on the other leg. My rear heel is up and off the ground. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. That completes our booty burning circuit training. I want you to go through that three. Uh, more times, two to three more times before you get into the core finisher. So, welcome to the core finisher. I'm gonna take you through uh, four or five exercises that are going to uh, engage the core, engage the hip flexors for stability, as well as challenge everything in the core with some more glute activation, glute burning exercises. Come back to your mat. In the plank position, tap and alternate the toes. 10 each side. Stay strong, finish strong. Good, one. Extension, keep the toe pointed towards the ground in the plank position. version of a sit-up. Try to keep our feet flat on the floor. Cross our hands over the chest. One, two, three, four, five, and quickly sit up. One, two, three, four, five, and one. One, two, three, four, five. That's three, four, one, two, three, four, Five and five. One, two, three, four, five and six. One, two, three, four, five and seven. One, two, three, four, five and eight. One, two, three, four, five. Hang in there. One, two, three, 
four, five, and last one, one, two, three, four, five, nice job, very good, okay, and finally, this exercise is very challenging, so we're gonna do three each side, lie on your back, opposite elbow to opposite knee, keep that far heel off the ground, and roll as slowly as you possibly can, and then push yourself back up. One, two, three, four, and up. One, two, three, four. Good, do six each side. One, two, three, good. I like to attach my heel to my thigh. One, two, three. One, two, three, good, all right. So do three to six reps each side, and that is your core finisher. I want you to do it two or three more times. If you know anybody who could benefit from these in-home, quick, easy, go anywhere, anytime workouts, please share one of the emails with them now so that we can help more people improve mental health, decrease stress, and boost energy while they're inside their home or traveling. Again, this is Dave Glazer, Fit Life Champions. I want to say thanking each and every one of you for all of your hard work. And don't forget to check in with me in the Facebook private page or on our weekly Zoom call 7 p.m. on Wednesday night. Talk to you soon.